Right, hello everybody and welcome to another tips and tricks guide for Sneaky Sasquatch. And in this one, we're going to be talking about the election tasks. The tasks that you actually have to do in order to become the mayor for Sneaky Sasquatch, or at least to try to run and become a mayor. Uh, keep in mind, you are running against Pimperton Jr., so this is going to be a very tricky one. You're going to have to do quite a lot of tasks here, and some of them are easy, some of them are just going to take a lot of work, and some of them are going to require you to kind of keep looking around and uh, find the right spot. So, that being said guys, let's just start up with the first task. And this one is about shaking hands with the people of course around town but when the duck is saying to go around town to look for these people to shake their hands you don't really have to go only around town you actually can go ahead and shake hands with people uh, almost about everywhere I think uh, I've tested it out and I've seen people that want to shake my hands at the golf course in the campground at the racetrack but to be honest, mostly, most of the people they're going to be able to find are going to be, of course, in town. I'd recommend you just go down there uh, during the daytime. First day in the morning, just go down there and uh, just keep on running around. Or maybe just drive around. And you are going to see some people that are going to request you to uh, shake their hands. And once you go in town and you spend a full day there, I'm pretty sure you're going to be able to probably do this one in one day. Maybe even two if that's not going to work. All right. Next up, we're gonna have the second task, which is gonna be the rent billboard. This is actually pretty easy. All you gotta do is just call those phone numbers for the billboards. Uh, one of them is gonna be on the road that's gonna take you to the town, and another one is gonna be on the highway that's gonna take you all the way up the mountain, just in case you don't have these phone numbers just yet. Uh, me personally, I already have these ones. You can actually see the locations of them in the video right now. But once you call these phone numbers, and if you already rented them out, instead of just canceling them, just say that you do not wanna cancel them, but instead you wanna edit them. And all you gotta do is just add the phone number that the duck that gave you the quest is gonna give you. You don't really have to remove the previous phone numbers that we have that was actually giving us passive income from the spaghetti guy in our own island. All you gotta do is just add yet one more phone number and it's still gonna apply, it's still gonna work. All right, for the third task that we gotta do here is gonna be, of course, installing signs around the map everywhere. Now, two things you gotta keep in mind for this one. Me personally, when I try to look for these signs, for some reason, I just couldn't find the last one. I was just stuck. But you gotta follow two rules. First rule, these signs are only gonna spawn in like close to roads. You're never gonna find these signs like if you go somewhere else, uh, let's say for the maze or the lake. The signs are not gonna be there. Only where there's a road, that's where the signs are gonna be. I'm guessing they're kinda placing them where people are driving by to be able to see those signs easily. And the second rule, if you're really stuck and cannot find one of these signs, then just simply go back to the duck that actually gave you this mission and he's gonna tell you every single time where you should go and look for more of these signs. But again, if you are still stuck, keep on watching the video as this video is actually showing you all 15 locations where you can find these signs, install them, and finish up the task.
All right, and lastly, for the final task, uh, all you gotta do is just make friends. Uh, this one is the best one yet, let me tell you all. This is just an amazing task that you gotta do, uh, showing us that you can now make friends in this game, and it's just so, so cool. Uh, apparently, you're gonna have to make eight friends with this one. Uh, by talking with the Doug that's gonna give you the mission, uh, he's also gonna give you a friend's guidebook, which is pretty cool because this friend's guidebook is also gonna allow you to call each one of these friends. Uh, each one of the person you're gonna be able to call, they're gonna have their own phone number and can actually call them instantly using that phone book. Uh, and I absolutely love that as well. Uh, another great thing about this guide is that it's also showing us uh, the location of every single one of these friends you're gonna be able to make because once you call them, you gotta remember kind of where they're located is so you can go ahead and pick them up. For example, if you're calling the instructor uh, slash the cone guy, uh, you're gonna have to make your way back to the racetrack and pick him up from there because he's gonna close down the shop and uh, he's gonna become a friend. Just chat with him real fast and then listen to what he wants to do for the day and keep on completing his tasks. Once you do enough of these, then he's gonna become your friend. Uh, sometimes you can actually take these persons out three times a day uh, before they go back home. Sometimes you can only take them out two times a day before they go back home. So it is gonna require quite a bit of work before you're gonna be able to uh, be friend eight of these fellas and the great thing about it is that even once uh, you're gonna be done with this mission you're gonna be able to keep on making friends uh, on and on and on and uh, befriend every single one of the character in the game and i absolutely love that about this game all right well that being said guys these are all the election tasks that you got to do in order to become the mayor or at least try to run as a mayor of course becoming the mayor and completing this uh, does take a few more tasks once you're done with this one but these are all the tasks that you got to do first before you can actually apply all right everybody thank you all very much for watching do not forget to leave a like, subscribe if you enjoyed this guide, and I'll see you all in the next one soon. Bye, everybody.